My name is Ken George, and I am the ambassador of the United States of America in Uruguay. One of the first things I did when I arrived in Uruguay was to participate in the National Science Fair organized by the Ministry of Education and Culture in Periopolis. I was impressed with Uruguay's science clubs, the commitment of the teachers and the creativity of the students. Since then, I have realized that the talent, work, commitment, and creativity of the Uruguayan youth and teachers are not always properly recognized. I like to recognize work that is done well and that contributes to the growth of our countries and the world. That is why I want to congratulate the MEC and especially the teachers, Catalina Olid, Silvia Perlas, and Carla Pereira, Juan Rocha y La Valleja, for encouraging their students to keep learning and working during the COVID-19 pandemic. Through the launch of the Desafio Científico, I especially want to congratulate the winning projects. From elementary school, Julieta de Negri from School 43 in Rocha, and from the middle school, Agustin Martinez de Linceo Enriqueta Comte y Rique of Tuacuarembo. Congratulations to both of the winners, their families and the teachers who supported and mentored them in this process. We know that because of COVID-19, virtual work and study requires new strategies and the use of new platforms and new ways of thinking. Even though it has been difficult for everyone, it has also helped us adapt for the new challenges. Creativity, flexibility, and adapting to changes are some of it. Congratulations on behalf of the people of the United States and the U.S. Embassy in Montevideo. We are excited to continue supporting youth science programs in Uruguay.